and historic experimental surgery was performed at the University of Maryland Medical Center. I have been rejected by every human transplant institute on the East Coast. We are now down to my only real hope. That patient is 58-year-old Lawrence Fawcett from Frederick. He spoke from his hospital bed before the surgery last week. He's a married father of two who served 20 years in the Navy. Fawcett has terminal heart disease and cannot receive a human heart. University of Maryland School of Medicine doctors implanted a genetically modified pig heart in Fawcett on September 20th. So far, he's doing well, breathing on his own without assistance. This is only the second time the medical team performed this surgery. The last time was in January of 2022. The heart was given to 57-year-old David Bennett. However, Bennett passed away two months later. Doctors are hopeful Fawcett's surgery will be more successful. We were very appreciative that, um, that he accepted our offer for the experimental transplant in the hopes it would help him, but also because um, this is a field that's just beginning and so much needs to be learned. Pretty amazing, right? It's estimated that more than 100,000 Americans are on a waiting list for human organs. More than 6,000 of them will die this year while waiting for a life-saving transplant. Perfect reminder of why advancements like this matter, possibly giving loved ones more time together.